let's get wolf pack good afternoon not morning um more than likely this is going to be a continuation of the previous episode and vlog i know it seems like we're all over the place and it seems and we are we are we're actually doing this we're like combining days and days it's just because uh, we have a lot on our agenda these past few weeks um, but as of right now, I'm actually getting ready to go to the gym. I have a busy schedule. Today is Tuesday, the 22nd. Um, tomorrow, it's Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving. And then that's when the, the chaos is going to start, right? My family and her family is coming over. Like I mentioned on the other videos, um, we're going to have 20 plus heads, you know, up in this house. We're going to host uh, a lot of people. <laughs> And yeah, but so I actually created, I'm going to leave the link. If you guys actually go into the description, there's our link tree. I'm going to go ahead and put our new Instagram page. It's just one word, DC Wolfpack underscore. That is going to be our new Instagram page going forward. Uh, obviously, you can also see our TikTok as well, too. Like I mentioned, I am going to be super active in all our socials, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, obviously. We want to grow this channel and become more than what it is because we envision this and you have to speak into existence and I know we will get there. It's going to take hard work, commitment, and time, uh, but also it will not get there unless we have the commitment of you guys, the Wolfpack. So, if you guys want to be a part of the wolf pack which we would appreciate it go ahead hit that subscribe button and like this video it goes a long way um it just it really does you know kind of like going back to all this so i got my buckled up pump and i got my ghost bcas i mix them together um it just it works for me I still take pre-workout, obviously. This is a pre-workout, it's non-stimulant, so you don't get all those caffeine jitterness, uh, which I don't like anymore. Um, so, let me just get this back. Okay, anyways. So like, like I said, y'all, we would appreciate it if you guys wanna be a part of the Wolf Pack. Let, grow, let us grow this channel, because we, I know we can do it. I know you guys know we can do it. It could be something amazing, and it will be something amazing. It's just gonna take some time and it's gonna take a lot of support and a lot of manpower to get there, right? It's not just me and Cecilia doing this or our booties, you know, the, the butts, but it's gonna take everyone uh, to make the effort to get this channel to its heights. This is gonna be my job. It's gonna be my 24 seven, you feel me? So this is what I'm doing and I'm not gonna stop. You know what's gonna be really crazy about this, y'all? A few months from now, a year from now, we're gonna watch this video together. And I guarantee you by then, our channel is gonna grow. We're gonna grow. The Wolf Pack is gonna grow. We're gonna have so many new members and family members a part of the pack, bro. It's gonna be wild, man. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be wild, it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a crazy ride. So strap up, buckle the up, and cheers. Here, here. Here is to, I, want, I don't want to say new beginnings, right? But here's to our success story. Here's to the wolf pack. Here's to you guys. Cheers. Also, we actually uh, got those bar stools. I gotta clean that up. And here's what they look like. They're cool, bro. I'm gonna go ahead and leave a link in the bio if you guys wanna buy them. You guys want to buy them? Uh, she got them from Target. Yeah, she, they're pretty comfortable. It's been hours late, later. I clean the stove, the oven, the stove oven. You know, you know what I mean. The top part of the oven, the oven itself. I clean the microwave, kitchen. Um, your boy did some work. You know, I sorted all of that going on. Um, Went to the gym, bro. Since I got home, bro, like my energy level went pew, shot straight down. Vacuum, it still looks a mess, but I vacuum both of the couches. Spray some like some Febreze stuff because these booties be making them stanky as hell. 
got the carpet still got to do with these boxes i wasn't sure if um she wanted to keep these uh bar stools or return them or whatever but there's that the ice chest is no longer here why is that it's because this right here it's a whole turkey that's filleted you can get it from costco all right just went ahead and put it in the refrigerator it's been cold it's been the ice chest i've been putting ice in it every day and then here is the turkey i got the turkey out it's pretty much thawed out and i'm actually going to put in this bucket a little ghetto i know this bucket right here uh, that's where my pops you know will get his um supplies from at the donut shop right here you know what i'm saying but anyways we're going to put in this bucket I'm gonna put a whole bunch of seasoning and stuff like that. I'll, I'll put it in the video when I do it. I'm gonna do when I get back when I pick her up from work and get some food. But I'm gonna do that tonight. I'm gonna make sure this turkey gets marinated tonight because today is Tuesday. Focus the 22nd. So it's gonna marinate for over 24 hours. And then I'm gonna throw this sucker first in the oven because I know that's gonna take about four to six hours to cook, whatever the case is. I mean, it's only a 16 pound bird, so I think it's gonna be pretty quick. I would say like anywhere from yeah four to six hours on low low heat, but anyways, and then once that's done, then we'll do all the um, the sides. We'll cook all the sides that need to go in the oven because they're gonna be quick. Then we're gonna put this fillet bird since it's kind of half. It should cook pretty fast. I would say this right here about two, maybe three hours tops. So I have to get started like around five in the morning to kind of get everything situated, get, get everything going because. Um, I don't know about you guys, but we don't have a set time when we eat, you know, football's on, everyone's chilling and drinking, we don't have a time, and just when the food's ready, we just grub, we just eat, yeah, and, man, I'm tired, but I don't want to drink any more coffee, I'm trying to calm down from the coffee, just because, you know, I, I do have heart problems, and earlier, even though I did my pre-workout, and it was a non-stimulant, it had to have caffeine in it, it still has some things where, you have to understand it's a pump, you know, so it's pump a lot of blood um, throughout your body. Obviously, what what's the mechanics that pumps your blood or the operating system is going to be from your, your heart. So, I just got to chill on that stuff, you know what I mean? But yes, that's where I'm at. Alright, y'all, so I'm going to start my broid. I got my bo my water. I got my water boiling. I'm going to go ahead. I got some brown sugar. So regular sugar this is like the organic kind black pepper green garlic salt onion powder and a few more spices and blends right here chili cayenne oregano thyme parsley and a little bit of ginger and I like a little spicy so, so I like some spicy so some chili flakes god I can't talk right now anyways so the, this is the brine and it's gonna go obviously in that bucket with the turkey and more than likely i'm gonna hit this seasoning again after it's been brining for over 24 hours also i'm gonna chop up some onions some garlic and oranges over here so i actually poured some water out simply because i'm actually going to add oj into as well too besides adding the actual oranges and I also forgot to soy sauce and we're gonna put some horse sauce now I'm just kind of following what I did last time uh, that one year when we lived in the condo <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I'm gonna go ahead measure everything right now Full cup, half a cup. Chill, bro. What are you doing? <laughs> it's like, you know that movie that's going on? Smile. Smile, and they're like, yeah. it's like this. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I'm using that organic sugar, huh? So, basically, a cup of sugar. Organic. Okay. And we'll go half a cup of brown sugar. And if you guys are like, oh my god, that's a lot. Well, it's supposed to be a lot because it's a big turkey. You gotta have to let it like get into all like its crevices and all that. The brown sugar was a little 
blocky. Oh. Okay, half a cup of brown sugar. We're gonna add a lot of salt, all right? Well, let's go half a cup first. We're gonna go half a cup of salt, just about, it's just about right there. Okay. Because we're at soy sauce, so we shouldn't get too, too crazy. But let's go ahead, add all the other seasoning. So half of half a cup of chili flakes. Granulated garlic. About half of half a cup. What is that, like a quarter? I don't know, I can't do quick math somewhere, no. Got the onion right here, the granulated onion. So again, about half of half a cup in there. Oh. Hey, what's going on over there? Hey, what are your green crazy to each other? Got some black pepper, again, half of half a cup. So, like I meant, I think I showed it in the, the video, I think the bird is about 15 pounds. Then I'll just add the rest of this right here. It's very small. This is chili powder. That goes in. Okay. So we got some oregano. We got some thyme. We got some parsley. So what's going on right here? So I'm just gonna mix all in. It looks like that as of right now. Okay. What else? OJ, soy sauce. Um, oh, ginger. All right. This one's right here about like, mm, I'll say about two tablespoons. Is it gonna make a difference? I don't know. I'm just kind of adding stuff is all I go, I'll be honest with y'all. But it works, because I know flavors, okay? I just don't know measurements. Soy sauce. Yeah. Okay, about half a cup of soy sauce. And. Orsha sauce. Unfortunately, I didn't buy the other bottle or the container where you just pour it. So I'm just adding the rest of this in here. And this is just about, uh, I will say the like, yeah, about half a cup, maybe a little less. Ooh, you can smell the seasoning. Damn, the thing is popping in there. Okay. Whoop, side it. All right. Now, let us stir. Where's the whisk? Okay, here we go. Get the camera right quick. Okay. We're gonna go ahead, focus. There we are. Stir. All right, so I've got my onions and my garlic. Nice, and it's just starting to boil too, so. Just put it in there. I think we should just let this kind of go on like medium high heat for roughly about about 10 to 15 minutes. So I'm gonna put about four oranges in there. I'm not gonna go too crazy with it just because we're gonna add orange juice. So I'm gonna cut it in half, squeeze, throw it in. Just squeeze, throw in, squeeze, throw in. And I use four of them. Now, once you're gonna ask, like, oh, we're gonna add the orange juice. So once we get that to a, a simmer where we want it to, then I'm gonna go ahead and cool it down with the OJ and some ice. Because obviously you can't put this brine in the turkeys and cook the turkey. You don't want that. So you want it to cool down. So that's where the, the OJ and the ice comes from. And, yeah. 
Again, we're gonna let this go for about 15 minutes, 10, 15 minutes. I'll say 15 just to be on the good side, so I can let that break down. But yeah. There we go. Okay. So just let that, oh, you, you, can you smell it? Mm -hmm. Some of the flavors. The flavors. Yeah, it's doing its thing. And small, I said I can't make a turkey. She's like, have you cooked the turkey before? I'm like, I felt insulted. What the hell? She's tripping. Insult. And she's like, well, I never had a turkey before. Yeah, he's made turkey before. Yeah. For mom and dad and for us. Yeah. I made turkey before for us. A little turkey breast. Breast, yeah. Okay, so we're just gonna let that do its thing. Again, about medium heat. All right, cool. We'll catch you in a bit. I'm getting started on the turkey. Remember to always grab all this nasty stuff out. Well, the gizzards and this, where the hell that is. <laughs> grab all the stuff out, rinse it, clean it, and then go in here, baby. I actually shut off the flames for about like, what? Six minutes now, six, eight minutes, almost 10. Just let it chill. Now let's go ahead and add the OJ. Um, let's roughly add about two to three cups. Honestly, just gonna just about fill it up. We'll go ahead and just whisk this real quick. Also, I don't have that little thingy where you like shoot the juices inside of the meat. So I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna go ahead and just kinda make holes on the turkey so that way the juices can get in there a lot easier when it is in the brine mode. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if you guys can see it or not, or... Bet! Bet bet! She's cleaning the bathroom and had her headphones in. All right, anyways, so that's fine. Okay, so. Got the ice with the chicken in the bucket. I put some OJ at the bottom. Gonna put the brine now. We're also going to add some water in there too, as well. There we go. Okay, so I think we're good. We're able to submerge the whole chicken in there as well. Just kind of push everything in. All right, there we are. Okay, and just let that brine do its thing. And then about in the morning of us cooking it, we're gonna take it, pat it down, dry it up. And then yeah, I'm kind of excited about it, man. Okay, what are you doing, bud? I'm making my cheesecake bag. Cheesecake bites. Yeah, I, this is my first batch. Don't judge it because I had to take it out because I only have one. Okay, so I'm just like that looks like a bag. Well, and it has to cool too. So. It, and unfortunately, she didn't record. Can you eat this? Yeah. What is this? What does it taste like? It's the filling. I mean, it has raw eggs. Well, it's good. But anyways. Oh yeah, this is that barf. <laughs> hey! Uh, <laughs> that is! <laughs> yeah. So this is the product of my... My cheesecake bites. They don't look very pretty, but it's because I didn't have a lot of the... These trays. So I had to take it out while it was still hot. So it fell apart. So I made those and then I have some up there. So um, hopefully they're okay for tomorrow, but whatever. It's the flavors that counts. You know. On uh, today that has butter. So I'm making my butter mix right here. I have the onions chopped up. 
Just put in the air fryer. Now I have my garlic right here. I'm gonna go ahead and squeeze out. So we got some oregano. Oh, why you put this in? But... Some parsley. As yours truly. Wang cow. And you can put like a good amount. Obviously, it's a big turkey. So you don't have to be shy with it. Thyme. Because we bought that thyme. I'm just gonna put a little bit of cayenne because I like some heat. Some people might not like it, but. I use her unsalted butter. And let's use all purpose seasoning right here. Ooh, so I, it's a lot of salt. Yeah, I yeah. did that purposely. And this is the same thing, but. Well, don't go too heavy headed just because the brine had salt too. It's a big, it's a big turkey, it's a big oh, bird. Okay, okay. 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 So now, that's what that concoction looks like right there. I'm just gonna mix it all up. Mm. Oh, you didn't chop up the garlic? You just, mm -hmm. just put it, put it in, in there, yep. Mm. I just wanna put that over some bread. So, just mix it all up, and then, I could leave it in the bowl, just let it chill in the refrigerator, or I could put it in the ceramic wrap. I think I might just put it in this round wrap. I don't have the lid for the bucket, <laughs> so what I did was I used <laughs> I used our tray that we do for pizza, and I just put a 25, 25 pound plate on there to let that chill there, do its thing. And it sucks because I want the lid. Why? I want to put the chicken. I mean the chicken. I want to put the turkey in the garage. In the garage. Yes, I said the garage. The reason why is because it's super cold lately in Cali, and the garage, bruh, it's like 30s in there, like low 20s too. Sometimes, uh, just about, yeah, like mid to low 20s. It gets really cold in there. Like now we're starting to get like icicles on our cars and the grass and the roofs and all that. But I wanted to put it in the garage because I know that's where it's really, really cold. Unfortunately, it's whatever. Anyways, um, I'm gonna actually go and clean up, get rid of all those boxes, do all that, and just pick up where I left off at. But I'm actually gonna go ahead, check out tonight, y'all. Peace out. I'll see you guys on Thanksgiving. This I don't think this is gonna be the end of the vlog, but if it is, you know what, it's not. I'll just see you guys Thanksgiving. Bye.